The following video contains coarse language and mature subject matter. It's a fucking horror unboxing. What were you expecting? Hey, I'm just me. Happy Halloween! Look, look, I have ears and skulls. For someone who's not feeling Halloween-y at all, I think I'm doing quite well. But you're not here to watch me Halloween. You are here because the title said, Loot Fright Unboxing. Probably. So here I have the Loot Fright. Ooh. Oh. This one was supposed to be here in May. October. It's Halloween. Well, it's Halloween when you're watching this. It's not actually Halloween when I'm filming this. It's the 17th today. It came yesterday. So, well, we've been waiting for this box. Um, sent out emails saying that they had declared bankruptcy. Sent out emails saying that they'd found new investors and our boxes were on the way. I got a box, so I guess they're good. I can't believe I'm going to say this. I appreciate the way that Loot Crate handled their financial biz issues. I like that they actually emailed us things as much as I desperately miss Nerdblock. Tear. Um, yeah, when they went under, they didn't tell us anything. They were just like, and they no longer existed. The boxes didn't come. The emails went unanswered. It was just poof. So at least Loot Crate gave us something. So now let's get on in here and see if it was something worth waiting for. Okay, so I'm gonna put this box here so you can't see it. And I'm gonna look over here so I can't see it. And the first thing, I guess, is the t-shirt. One thing I will say is that their t-shirts have gotten better. My complaint about them the before, before they had the Fright one, was that their t-shirts were garbage. The one I got in the last Loot Fright, the, the fly one, the glow in the dark, it's still kicking. It hasn't torn to pieces or anything. And this feels like the similar material. Okay, so let's see what it is. It's Frankenstein. Let's see. So, I, I like Frankenstein. I like the classics. I really do. I'm kind of over vampires, but like Frankenstein, Wolfman, Swamp Thing, like... I'm down. Also, anything with Vincent Price in it, because, you know... Vincent Price. Okay, the next thing is uh... Ooh, okay. <laughs> For a second there, I was gonna be like, I already have this. You know what? I do already have this. With a different facial expression. I'll get that one in a minute. So this is Texas Chainsaw Massacre. It's leather face. It's a leather flame. A leather face play flu. Leather face plushy. That's the words. Cute. Gotta remember not to crush the spider. She's getting big. Okay. This is the one I got from Horror Black. Or from an old loot crate? Okay, I've opened a lot of boxes here, okay? It is very hard for me to remember who did what when. But, now I have two leather faces with slightly different facial expressions. They're like twins, they could be besties. He's so happy about it. He's so unimpressed about everything.
So there you go. <laughs> That's really all I have to say. Um, I like plushies. They're cute. I like Texas Chainsaw Massacre. It was less cute. <laughs> um, moving on. Another thing that feels like fabric. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. I know that we got this. This exact thing. In a horror block. Not that I have anything against Camp Crystal Lake. I guess... I guess I hang that up next to Paper Pal. Anyway, so, uh, yeah. Not, not my favorite movie. Not my favorite franchise. Either of these, actually. But, I mean, they're classics. They're like... All of these. Mostly this one. But they're classics. <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, like... I can't complain when I get merch from things that, like define the genre, right? So, let's see. Pin. Do I want to see the pin or do I want to see other stuff first? I'm holding the pin. The pin we have. The Fog. That's pretty cool. If you subscribe to a Loot Crate, any of them, um, you get pins, and then you can go online and get uh, DLC with them. Just like, pin code pins. And stuff. I never do, because I don't care. <laughs> I don't really want to download stuff. So. Um, this feels like a book. This is a book. Ooh. The Overlook Hotel. Ooh. <gasps> is this the Shining and Stationery together? Yes. Ooh. Okay. I'm <laughs> getting carried away. It's a little journal designed to look like the, uh, the guest book from the Overlook Hotel. Obviously from The Shining. And then... Iconic carpet pattern. And the lined pages. I don't know. Oh, well the camera even. Can you see? Oh, we're getting a Playmate jacket. Oh boy. Ugh. Ow. <laughs> This is fun. I saw a thing. I thought I saw a thing. There's the maze in the metal. That's cool. This is clearly my favorite thing so far. I'm a stationary nerd, okay? I don't know what you want from me. Journals, pens, erasers, I just love it all. Moving on. <laughs> um, we got this. Uh, okay. Um. This seems terribly out of place. It's a, basically an advertisement for the Lost, Closet, Lost Causes of Bleak Creek. It's Rhett and Link's book. I think it's book. Rhett and Link from Good Mythical Morning. Two of the people who inspired this channel, actually. And it's like... 
big solid kind of bookmark. Are you advertising a book with a bookmark? I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> Next, we got uh, this thing. Ooh, it says the word Jaws, so I love it. Okay. Dear Loot Crate, whomever's in charge. This is unnecessary. This is unnecessary. There's already a box. So, not everything needs to be wrapped in plastic. Especially not the Jaws thing. Like, you just throw this plastic in the ocean and murder mm -hmm. some sharks. Anyway. <laughs> Okay, what is it? Yeah, it's a beach closed sign that's been bitten. It's adorable. I love Jaws. Jaws is my favorite movie. <laughs> well, no. The Labyrinth is my favorite movie. Jaws is my second favorite movie. <laughs> so that's terribly dangerous. That's sharp. Like, they're trying to cause bloodshed. Why am I shaking so much? <sighs> anyway. Okay. So that was useless. And finally, another advertisement for something? Okay... The paper, the cardstock's really nice. And the card that tells us what we just got. I guess I'll go over super quickly. When it comes to horror, it's all relative. Join Loot Freight's one big stabby family as we celebrate crazy clans and bad broods with flesh and blood. Texas Chainsaw Massacre Leatherface Plush. Uh, I got the frowny one. I got the frowny one. Texas Chainsaw Massacre Leatherface Plush. The family that slays together stays together. Pay homage to everyone's favorite cannibalistic clan with this Leatherface Plush. A looter favorite past a looter favorite past item you'll receive their either happy or sad leather face so we must have had a halloween version like a, a halloween loot crate and now i have them both don't have to chase an item oh don't have to chase this item sorry i'm i'm in a mood leave me alone. so anyway then we've got exclusive Jaws metal print sign. Jaws metal print sign. It's a metal print sign. Exclusive Bride of Frankenstein t shirt. I really like this. Exclusive. Oh, these are so exclusive. The Shining Journal. It's just so cool. Where's the maze in the middle? If there's that maze in the middle. <laughs> yeah, this thing is cool. And exclusive, apparently. Another exclusive. See, every all the great, all the, the blue things, everything's exclusive. Except this guy. Oh, well, sorry. Well, this guy. Anyway, exclusive. The fog pin. It's not the mist. It's not the swarm. It's the fog. Uh, celebrate this John Carpenter classic with a pin featuring the ghost of Captain Blake.
Have I seen this movie? I must have seen this movie. Huh. I don't know if I've seen that movie. And then finally, the... Oh. Oh, this one's not exclusive. It's bonus. Bonus. Friday the 13th of the Camp Crystal Lake Pendant. You know, I gotta tell you, I feel better about it being a bonus. <laughs> if you're gonna give, like, a, a bonus item, okay. Something like this, that works. Yeah, I don't really know what else to say about any of this. Um, was it worth the wait? I guess we'll see how many views this gets. <laughs> I mean, I like the plushie. I think it's, I think it is kind of cool that now I have both of them. As someone who collects things, as you can tell. <laughs> uh, I really like the journal. The journal is nice. So, that was everything in Flesh and Blood, Loot Fright. I'm pretty sure this was supposed to be Maze. So, there you go, if that means anything to you. The inside of this box is cute. So... Like this if you like this, comment, subscribe for new videos, um, there won't be a video next week, November 7th, because on the 6th, I'm going in for surgery. So, uh, I'm gonna be unconscious through most of the 7th, hopefully, um, and I'm just not going to upload when I'm unconscious. <laughs> Sorry. I have pre-recorded three videos, so I should have those up in November, and I should be back by December. Hopefully. <laughs> um, and beyond that... Never know how to say bye. So, while well, we've been waiting for this box, the world ended, and also... <laughs>